hi guys welcome back to the channel today's recipe is a classic one from jamaica specifically it's hard dough bread this food is synonymous with the island i don't think you will get it anywhere else in the caribbean and it's a great symbol of jamaican food our ingredients to start with as always we have some plain flour you could use bread we have some milk some sugar some butter this is quite rich some water some yeast a little bit of salt and that's it so to start with we want to heat our milk a little just going to add that to the pan heat it lightly you don't want it too hot then in a jug whilst that's heating we're going to put in our yeast and then the sugar because the sugar feeds the yeast then we're going to add the water to this and then once the milk has heated not too hot bear in mind we're going to add that because if it's too hot it will kill the yeast just mix all that together and then we're going to set that aside to let the yeast start to activate next we want to prepare the dry ingredients so i've got the flour here i'm just going to add that to the bowl some salt and our butter and then just rub that in just get the butter breaking up a little bit it's coating in the flour and that should be fine we can see here our yeast mix is active we want to add that into our flour mix and then just bring that together starting with a spoon then you can start to use your hands and then you want to knead this dough the more you knead it the better i would say a good 10 to 15 minutes if you have a bread mix that's even better but give it a really good good knead until you get a nice smooth soft dough like this so now we want to leave it to prove so i'm just going to place it in a bowl and cover it with a tea towel and leave it in a warm place for an hour at least once you see it's doubled in size like this it's ready to be rolled out so i'm just going to flour our surface knock back the dough which just means to press out the air a little as you can see here and then we want to turn it out so i'm just pressing out any excess air because the next thing we want to do is roll out the dough so for hard dough bread in the pan it's rolled first so i'm just going to roll it out to about two centimeters thick and then we just want to roll it on itself like this and then the next thing we want to do is get it into our baking tin to prove again so i'm just going to take a little bit of oil and just rub the outside of the dough and also the inside of the tin so that it comes out nicely when it's baked. Next, we wanna just place that dough that we've rolled into the tin like this, and we're gonna leave it to prove a second time for another 30 minutes or even an hour. But either way, you want it to double in size again and that gets a nice rise on it. So now this is proved nicely. You can see it's doubled in size. This is ready to be baked. So we're gonna place this in the oven on 150 for about an hour. And here we have it here is our hard dough bread look at that absolutely amazing it's a proper loaf this is once it's nice and golden brown and also it sounds hollow when you knock it that's when you know it's cooked so when we slice into it you can just see how soft it is on the inside and that butter has created this really really nice rich dough as you know hard dough bread to be so that is basically it guys I'm gonna literally eat this with some butter now. This, that is my favorite way to eat bread. Nice and simple. I really hope you enjoyed this one and I hope you just use this as your everyday bread recipe because honestly, it was so simple. Until the next time, peace and love.